Okay, so I finally decided to get this Pac-Man light. I've been eyeing down online for a while. Picked it up on Amazon for about 28 bucks. Love Pac-Man, 1980. It came out by Namco. Changed the arcade industry along with Space Invaders prior. So this is the Paladone Pac-Man light. As you can see, we got three of the ghosts changing Pac-Man. It's titled Pac-Man and the Ghost Light. And we got Blinky, Clyde, and Inky. So which ghost are we missing? And no, it's not Stinky. But I'm not going to tell you. You're going to have to let me know in the comment section your guess. And then at the end of the video, I will let you know which ghost they're missing. And as you can see, it includes three modes. We got standard lighting, color phasing, and music reaction. And they all work pretty good, just like Action Jackson did. So you can see on the top it says Pac-Man and the ghosts again. Let's take a look at the back, Jack. Actually, we got some cool side box art right here. Pac-Man reaching for the stars. I like that, or reaching for the ghosts. And in the back, it's just more design artwork a little bit that I told you about. But it comes in a nice sturdy box. And let's open it up and show you what we got. So here we go, guys. Here's how it looks out of the box, and it is very cool, very bright, very vibrant, even though it's not lit up yet. And again, we got the three ghosts. Are you thinking of the answer for the fourth ghost? Keep thinking. But this is pretty cool. It's very light. I probably would want it to be a little stronger, and the plastic feels, I don't want to say cheap, but this seems, I don't know, it's solid for what it is, but I feel like it should have more weight. Um, but it definitely does what it does, and it packs a big punch. I mean, you could just ask Pac-Man. The whole time, these ghosts are trying to catch him, and they never, ever do, because he's that good, just like Mr. Do. All right, guys, so why don't we light this up and see what we gots. Okay, guys, first, before we start, just so you know that there is a charger in the back, so you can plug it into the wall, although it doesn't come with the plug, which is disappointing. But you get the charger and you can use it standard with any phone or it takes some AAA batteries, I think three. All right, so you got a button here to the right and when you turn it on, look at that. Pac-Man lights up with all the ghosts beautifully. And by the way, this does have some pretty cool detail and I like how it's got the little cubes or squares. And we got all the ghosts lit up. How cool is that, guys? That is pretty awesome and badass in my opinion. This would be a great collector's piece, display piece. If you like the LED lights, and these are LED lights, if you like lights like this in your room, I mean, this is perfect. Retro 80s Pac-Man. Cowabunga. Actually, no, Cowabunga was Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, I think. All right, so if you push the button again, it does that phasing. And that's actually pretty cool. So you can see like it looks like they're trying to chase Pac-Man. But Pac-Man ain't biting. He ain't getting caught. Because he's the man. And then in time, he even found the woman. Miss Pac-Man, who I also liked a lot. I used to love playing Miss Pac-Man. But that's pretty awesome, guys. I mean, I am impressed with this. It is priceless. It's got his weight worth in power pellets, as they would say. And then if you push the button again, it actually does the music. Um, but I can't play music because it's copyrighted, but somehow it's picking up my voice and it's thinking my voice is music, I think. But I have played this with music, even from YouTube or whatever, and it's pretty cool. The blinks do light differently according to the music, which is pretty cool. So let's see if I stop talking. Yeah, and it stopped. So it's even voice activated. You could have a conversation with somebody and the ghost would react to it. And then obviously the last button is just to turn it off. So guys, this is just very impressive in my opinion. I mean, I love it. Um, I'll put a link in the description below. You guys can purchase it. And I hope somehow they come out with more, you know, video game, arcade game type lights like this. Um, Paladine seems to sell stuff like this. I also picked up a Pac-Man mat, which was pretty cool, but I'm really into the lights. Alright guys, so that's it. If you enjoyed the video and if you enjoy my channel, then please give it a thumbs up and subscribe because I do enjoy making these retro 80s, 90s type videos that are always fun for all ages. 
Take care. See you later. Ah, so you probably thought I wasn't going to tell you. So the fourth ghost is Pinky. And as you can guess, Pinky is pink.